with Seppy 7, and today I'm going to keep playing Earthbound. Last time, we uh, found another sanctuary place. Hello, hello, I will have you. Yes, please. Yes, please. Excellent way to start the uh, episode. And, uh, Magic Butterfly made me relax. Excellent! Okay. Anyways. Uh, goods. Oh, I have exactly a thousand bucks. Cool. Um, what am I doing? Side Caramel Franklin Badge. What am I doing? I kind of forgot, actually. I should have watched the last episode. What was the anti-blue place like? Was it scary? Oh, yeah, I remember you. you seem to thrive in places like that. Oh, right, I gotta find the... I gotta find a guy. How's it going? You might misunderstand what I have to say, but Carpenter's voice affects one's mind like a hypnotist. I feel like that I... that's not... Like... How would I misunderstand that? Hello. One day Mr. Carpenter received a revelation. He now speaks the real truth. So you say? You want to talk to Mr. Carpenter directly? You must think you're pretty important, and boy do you have a lot of nerve. You deserve to be struck by lightning. Fuck you. Is he in here? Yeah. Probably. Blue, blue, don't bother us. We're in the middle of a prayer. Okay, I'll move out of your way. Go quickly. Oh, shit, thanks. I didn't even... I just randomly... Problem here. Blue, blue, I'll stand somewhere else. Blue, blue, lagoon, blue, blue. Well, that doesn't help. Blue, blue. What? Are you saying that I'm only capable of walking in place? That's not true, see? Green, green... Oh, that's not it. I'm still new at this. Blue, blue. Now I got it. Blue, blue. Izaki opened the presents. There's a skip sandwich inside. Izaki takes it. Oh yeah, it makes you run around fast. I forgot about that. Blue, blue. Hey you, anti-blue boy. You're getting on my nerves. Oh shit. Uh, okay, well, I'm gonna beat the shit out of him in front of his friends. That was easy. And they don't seem to give a shit. No problem here. No problem here. No problem here. God damn it. Wow, the frame rate is dropping because there's so fucking many of them in here. Alright, well, at least I got that. Uh, are any of you gonna move? Blue, blue, don't disrupt our meeting or I'll stomp on you or something like that. I accidentally press interact too quickly. Well, I am just obliterating them now. It's not even a competition over here. No problem here. No problem here. Damn it. Okay, well... How about you? 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 You look like my man. Nope. Are you my man? Come on now. Okay, fine. Fuck you. Blue, blue. What? I'm blocking you? Oh, I'll move out of your way. Blue, blue, I moved out of your way. <laughs> okay. Well, there is a problem here, you see. What the hell? Blue, blue, I say, arm the torpedoes full speed ahead. Or something like that. So now I'll crush you. These guys remind me of Lancer. From Delta Rune. I think I played that on the channel, right? Or was it Undertale? No, Undertale I played by myself. But anyways, the point is, the, even their sprite looks like it. And that was just to get in a fight, I guess. Okay, well, I'm glad that I'm finally actually making some progress as far as this room goes. Uh, there's no point in interacting with them. Blue, blue, oh, you'd like to be one of us? Then give up what you're doing and go meet the great Mr. Carpenter as soon as possible. Izaki opened the presents. There's a croissant inside. Izaki takes it. No problem here. Well, I think there is, actually. 
This dude's walking out of sync. Okay, fine. Fuck you. Really? Uh, a few of them were walking out of sync. Blue, blue, give up what you're doing and go meet the great Mr. Carpet Zero as soon as possible. I'm trying to, but I can't find him and you're not helping me find him. So fuck you. No problem here. No. No. Blue, blue, lagoon, blue, blue. Oh, you must have moved already. The ones that I can move out of the way seem to move a lot faster than the other ones. Like this guy down here that doesn't seem to... Oh wait, can I even get down there anymore? I must be able to. I got out of the... Blue, blue, give it what you're doing. He moved back. Interesting. And now he won't move again. Huh, okay, well, I guess I'll go up here, see if I can find any more. Both of you look suspicious. Blue, blue. I'm trying to learn how to whistle. <laughs> I heard that... <laughs> that was actually pretty funny. I heard that whistling makes one smile. I'll practice over there. Blue, blue, you strange unmasked fellow, don't go to heaven. Yeah, that's always something that I've, I've addressed this several times in other JRPGs that I've played, but, like, I wonder how puns work in translation. Like, was there a pun and they just decided to reword the entire thing so that they could translate it? Okay, I'm assuming he'll probably attack me. How's it going? Blue, blue, why would a person who's not blue be here? Why is there two of you there now? Hello? Is that a glitch? I guess so. Well, I made it. You're Mr. Carpenter? Oh, you look like a secretary. I, I screamed. Because I didn't know what else to do. Right, okay. Well, that guy's weird. <laughs> ah, okay. This looks a bit more grand. Thanks for coming. I've been waiting for you. I need your assistance to help make the world blue and change it to happy, uh, a happy and peaceful society. Will you be my right-hand assistant? Uh, well, I'd like to like, uh, know a little bit more about the semantics of your whole operation here first. If you don't want to be my right hand, my left would be just fine. Just kidding, your existence is a problem for me and my religion. Defy me and I'll end your pitiful game. Carpenter's lightning was reflected by the Franklin badge! <laughs> Got him. Mr. Carpenter attacked. This is really weird. Alright, well anyways, um... Let's start things off with a bash. 47 hit points. A crashing boom attack. Didn't hit anyone. Uh, ooh, my Franklin badge did 80 more damage to him. Do it again, I dare you. Try to life up a... Eh, okay. And I miss. A paint attack, 31 points. Alright, that's not too bad. He's a crashing boom. Got him. 143. Oh, that was easy. Alright, that wasn't much of a boss fight. I think that was just like a character fight. Izaki gained 1,412 experience. I guess I was wrong about it not being a boss fight. Did you see the Mani Mani statue behind me? Since I got the statue, I have been doing peculiar things. Please forgive me if you can. I just wanted to have a normal life. I apologize to everyone. Here's the key to open the jail in the mountain cabin where Carla is being held. Take the key and go. Your backpack is full. You should take this even if you need to throw away one of your items. Yeah, I should. I'll just eat that croissant. Izaki got the key to the cabin. You see, the problem with making a cult like this that is so loyal to you that they will transform their entire basis of living to surround your needs, or not your needs, but your ideology, is that once you start changing your mind, 
somebody else will take your place. Your cult is going to turn against you if you turn against them. And that's really the creepiest part about it. Because, you know, like, political ideologies could be like a virus sometimes. I mean, I suppose this isn't super political and more societal, but still. You know, I mean, it's... You know, one person thinks it's a good idea, they tell ten other people, and when that first person doesn't think it's a good idea anymore, those ten other people still think it's a good idea. And then that first person who came up with the whole idea in the first place is now the enemy of their own idea. And it starts to get pretty creepy. But anyways, uh... Yeah, okay, same thing. Can I grab that statue? Damn. So you're the boy that, that, you went after Mr. Carpenter and you're awesome. Alright. Oh, this is creepy. Looks like almost everyone woke up and left. There are only three people remaining. I don't want to stay. I'll get out of here. Sorry about everything. Let's be buddies. Huh. <clears throat> well, so much for my whole spiel about, you know, social followings and all that, cults and political ideologies. I'll, I'll just go ahead and say it was magic. What a horrible nightmare. I somehow woke up. Actually, it probably was magic considering that statue, those statues seem to have a somewhat Lord of the Rings kind of power, like one ring to rule the moral sort of power. That's not going to make any sense to you if you don't know what Lord of the Rings is. Um, exactly, let's be friends again. Or, well, I mean... I, they seem to have a sort of... If you haven't seen Lord of the Rings, basically... The gist is, is that there's a ring that's, like, super powerful, but its power draws people in. Like, they start to get kind of... freakishly addicted to it. To the point that they would kill somebody for it without really even knowing what it is. Um... So it sort of seems like the little statues have that kind of effect. Please answer me. I promise to be good. Uh, okay? Not okay. You suck. You're the worst character in the entire game. God, you're slow. Ha! Ah, I lied to you, sucker! God, I told you he sucked. Mr. Carpenter was pretty strange. So was everyone else. Yeah, you were pretty mean to me, too. Now, what's the good word? Finally, I have a chance to apologize. Okay, well, thank you. I woke up on the dream. Huh. I like the old music better. But I am glad that this place is... Uh, reformed. Might have been listening to the evil messages rather than good. Or to evil messages rather than good. Oh, hi-ho. Oh, hi-ho. No problem here. Interesting. I wonder if there's a way to get in there. I want to see if this cow is different. The blue cow thing wasn't such a great idea after all, huh? Yeah, I mean, it's even its shadow is blue. Oh my god. You really think I was a bad boy? I don't even remember you, to be honest. <laughs> I apologize. Man, the dialogue. Riveting. They really fucking went all out on that guy. <laughs> My wife has run away for a second time. I'm such a lucky man. <laughs> okay. Wait, w w what? Has run away for a second time. I'm such a lucky man. Oh, okay. Strange dude. <laughs> um, though you may not believe it, I'm a healer. Oh, yes, you're the... That guy. Do you need some help? Nope. Mm, come back when necessary. What is this song from? I know that I've heard it elsewhere in the game. Is this the same as the Tucson theme? theme? It was hard on the oh, it was hard on the eyes to have everything blue. Yeah, honestly. I didn't mention it before, but it was definitely apparent. We need to return the town to its original colors. I'll be very busy. They said someone named Pokey stole all the food from the food stand. Uh-huh. Sounds like him. 
I heard many footprints exist steep down in the East Cave. People call that place Lilliput Steps, and it makes them feel uneasy. It made me feel pretty good. The music is awesome. What was the anti blue plate? Oh, wow. Huh. That guy's unchanged. She's still a believer. <laughs> okay. Um. Not all of our uh, products are blessed. Nothing blue drugstore. <laughs> oh, hey, even the theme here changed. Uh. You, I want to save. Well, that was pretty cool. Um. Then I guess I'll go get Carla. I don't actually even remember. Who's up here, maybe? What's good? There's nobody in here. Yes, this is the correct direction. Come at me. I dare you. All right, your loss. Uh, one HP. One HP. Forty-seven to the first. Ninety-seven to the second. Destroyed. And I got a cookie. Oh well, yes. No, I guess I don't. Yeah. Okay, then. Hello, hello! I have the key! Is that key? You got the key. Are you hurt? Uh... I don't know. What's my max HP? I guess I am. I'm sorry for all the trouble I caused you. Oh, that's not what I meant. I thought they would heal me if I said yes. Oh. No, wait. Don't... Uh, goods. Key to the cabin, use. Izaki, use the key to the cabin. What's good? Again, thank you, Izaki. You're just like I imagined you would be. I'm sure that some people in Tucson are worried about me. Getting back there may be dangerous, but we can do it if we can buy in our strength. I'm able to use a little psychic power th uh, that is actually pretty deadly. Let's head back to Tucson. Oh, that was a backpack. I'm surprised they let you keep that. Carla joined you. Excellent. Oh, oh, it's a teddy bear. Ah, okay, cool. Um, but actually, I went back and watched the first, uh, the first bit of the first video that I recorded of this series, and um, wow, the music in here is actually pretty, pretty banging. Can I go in here? <laughs> it locks. Game over. Um, but uh, and Carla is one of the people that I named. So her name could be anything, potentially. It's you again! My favorite character in the game! Picture is taken instantaneously. I'm a photographic genius, if I do say so myself. Okay, get ready for an instant memory. Look at the camera. Ready? Say, Fuzzy Pickles. Wow, what a great photograph. I'll always bring back the fondest memories. Oh my gosh, you have almost no hit points. I hope that that can be changed. Spy of Crows, big grin. Uh, dodge. One HP. One. One. Okay, uh, let's look at the size. Size so freeze. And. Goods. You have a bread roll and the teddy bear. Ray. Sure. Yeah, that'll do it. You won! Zaki and Carla gained 2 XP each. Enemy left her present. There's a cookie, and Zaki took it. Wait a minute. I have double the space now. Oh, that is so nice. I just realized that. That's... Yeah, that'll, that'll definitely come in handy. Oh, the reason she's only doing one point of damage is because she doesn't have any weapons, probably. I will... Equip... Her with that. I'll look at the shop. And happy, happy village. Right here. Hello. Hello there. Uh, may I help you? Yes. Can I get you anything? Hold on, refreshing herb. Herb. 
herb. I don't know. Croissant, scoop sandwich, lucky sandwich, can of fruit juice, can of cup of coffee. No. I thought they would have weapons. All right. Zaki, it's your dad. I deposited 15 bucks into your bank account. Taking away what you spent, you now have $1,698 in the bank. Well, experience points to get to the next level. 986. Carla, six. Um, what do you need from me? Uh, record. All done. Okay, well, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, then please leave a like and subscribe to join the Coral Rebellion. If you have any suggestions for games for me to play or is someone who commenting more enjoyable, don't hesitate to leave a comment. That's about it. See ya.